And uh, most people said Barack Obama. So what he said is, do you still do you support Obama's views? But he, he attributed all of McCain's views to yes. Obama. Yes. And, and it didn't it cause didn't sway even, anyone. But it didn't cause people to even flinch. They no. went right along. This is crazy. So listen to this. Some people speculate that blacks are voting for Obama strictly because he's black and not because of his policies. So we took McCain's policies and pretended they were Obama's. This is what they had to say. For the election, Obama or McCain? I like Obama. Now, what don't you like about McCain? McCain seems to not really know what he's doing right now. Are you more for Obama's policy because he's pro-life or because he thinks our troops should stay in Iraq and finish this war? I think because our troops should stay in Iraq and finish this war. I'm really for him with that. Definitely. Okay. Now, how about as far as um, him being pro-life? Do you support Obama in that case? Yeah, I do. I do. I support him in that case. And if he wins, would you have any problem with Sarah Palin being vice president? No, I would not, not at all. all. Not so at you, th you, you, you think he made the right choice in that? I definitely do. Thank you very much, sir. Have, a great, have a great day. So the guy agreed with everything McCain is for, except he said it was for Obama. <laughs> Here's another example. Are you for Obama or McCain? Obama. Okay, and why not McCain? Well, I just don't agree with some of his, you know, policies. No. Now. Obama says that he's anti-stem cell research. How do you feel about that? I, I believe that's... I wouldn't do that either. And I'm anti-stem cell, yeah. You are, yeah, anti-stem cell research. Now, if Obama wins, do you mind Sarah Palin being vice president? No. No, I don't. <laughs> All right, there you go. And then our third example, which uh, we found this woman. In this election, Obama or McCain? Obama. Now, why not McCain? What don't you like about him? Um, he sort of doesn't sound like he has enough... Like he does, he's not he's uneducated because when he had the um, they had the both of the presidents speaking, um, he didn't sound like he knew what he was talking about too much. Whereas Obama had facts and information when he was speaking. Good point. Let me ask you this: Do you support Obama more because he's pro-life or because he says our troops should stay in Iraq and finish the war? Um, I guess both. Now, if Obama wins, do you have any problem with Sarah Palin being his vice president? No. Um, no. No, I think she'll do a good job. I think she'll do a good job. Are you glad he elected her to be the VP if he wins? Yep. Thank you very much. All right, there it is, Sal in Harlem. And, uh...